What's up guys, I'm Chirag and welcome to part 9 of tutorial series on deploying the Flask application on the EC2 instance with Docker. In the previous tutorial, I had taken you through how we can use bridge driver or bridge network driver and communicate among containers and the host network, right? And now in this tutorial, we will go through on how to deploy multiple Flask application running on different ports using Docker and how we can serve it via Nginx web server, right? So as I said, here we are going to run two Flask application in a separate container, which will be running on different ports. And both the Flask application will be served via Nginx web server. So, well, let's see how we can achieve that. So I have the Flask application running as per our part seven of this tutorial series, right? And I have already logged in into the EC2 instance, right? So here, uh, if I do sudo docker ps, so we have two containers running. That is our Flask application and the Nginx server, right? So the very first thing that we will do is that we will create a, another Flask application, right? So ls. So what I will do is I will simply copy this directory that is Flask app hyphen Docker, right? And this is how I will create another Flask application. So I will say copy hyphen r that is a recursive flask app hyphen docker and I will name it as flask app one hyphen docker enter and we have the another flask application ready. So here we have to uh, do certain changes. So let's see. So let's go to flask app one now the very first thing that we will do is we will go to flask app go to templates and here we will add it home.html right so that uh, we can identify which application is running so here uh, instead of welcome I will put welcome to another flask application right and we will save this now once we are done with the template change we are going to edit the docker file of this specific flask application right so So let me clear this out. So we are not changing anything within a uh, flask app hyphen Docker application. It's going to stay as it is, right? So the only thing we have to change in the another flask application is the port number, right? So our default flask application will be running on port 8000. So we cannot run another flask application on port 8000, right? So we have to uh, modify the port. So that's what we are going to do in the Docker file of flask app one hyphen Docker, right? So vim Docker file. So here instead of 8000, uh, we will put something else. So I will say 8080 instead of 8000. Right and save this. Now once we are done with this change, uh, we have to go ahead and edit our uh, Nginx configuration file, right? So navigate to Nginx. So we will edit flask app dot configuration file. So vim flask app dot configuration file. So now here we want to serve two flask applications. So what we are going to do is we are going to copy this and paste it below. Now here instead of uh, 
o dot o dot o dot o colon 8000 our another flask application or the second flask application will be running on 8080 right so we have to edit this port so that's 8080 and we will be listening on let's say 8888 port right so our default flask application will be served on port number 80 and another flask application uh, will get served on port number 8888 right so save this now finally uh, we have to modify the docker compose file right so save him docker compose dot yml so here we had not mentioned ports right because we are using a uh, host as a network driver so by default it uses the uh, system network right so now here we have flask app so we have to add one more container for another flask application right so So the one above is our default flask application that refers to flask app hyphen docker directory uh, i mean the docker file within that directory right now this is another container uh, i will say flask app one and if you remember then uh, we can't have same container name so i will define as flask app one right and we have to modify this reference path. So now instead of flask app hyphen docker, this will refer to flask app one hyphen docker, right? So this will run our default flask application. This will run another flask application. And here we have our Nginx server, right? So this application will be running on port 8000. This will be running on port 8080. And Nginx will be serving one application on port 80 and another uh, application on port 8888, right? So let's save this. Now, apart from this, we are also using port 8888, right? So we have to make sure that we had opened that port within security groups. So let's have a look. So select your instance, scroll down to security groups, say view and bound rules. So here we have only port 80 and port 8000 and port 22, right? So we have to add port number 8888, right? So click on this uh, security group that is docker hyphen flask in my case. Select that, click on inbound, say edit. Now here say add a rule, mention the port number that's going to be 8888 anywhere say save and now a uh, port double eight double eight is open right so now let's go back to the terminal and uh, run the containers right so let me clear this out so it's going to be sudo docker compose up hyphen hyphen build and So now as you can see uh, flask app and flask app one uh, both are running right and our nginx web server is also up right so let's try to access the application let me copy this so we will uh, try to load the default flask application first and it's running fine right now we will try to load another flask application that is on port 8888 enter and as you can see welcome to another flask application and the another flask application is also running right so now if we look at the container so let me stop this and add hyphen d parameter so that we can detach now it's running let's try to reload this and it's working fine right now if we do sudo docker container ps so now you will be able to see three containers running that is flask docker underscore nginx so let me maximize this 
yeah so we have nginx flask application one and our default flask application that is flask app right so two container for different application and the third container is is for nginx right so well uh, this is how you can deploy multiple flask application using docker and this is how you can serve both the application using single uh, nginx web server on different ports right so well uh, that's it for this tutorial until that time if you want me to do a tutorial on any use case or service then please leave them below and i will try my best to come up with a tutorial as soon as possible and if you have any queries or comments then again please leave them below and don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and see you next time